Welcome to Solo Banff Gaming. Um, please like and sub, uh, subscribe. I'd appreciate that. Um, I don't have enough YouTube vi viewers or subscribers to actually generate quote unquote ad revenue. So you're getting ad free content. So um, if you would, I would really appreciate a uh, subscription. All right. Um, we already did the eyeball chest for Hogsmeade. We have a video out on that. I waited for the Hogwarts one because you need a level. You need to unlock a level three chest or door rather. Sorry. Um, and we just didn't have that capability. So now that we have that, um, let's get into it. So the first one that we're going to do is going to be defense against the art. Um, sorry, I have a cold. It's hard for me to talk without coughing in people's ears. Uh, so we're going to against the defense against the dark arts class room. There we go. I'm trying to mute myself as I cough, but apologies if it slips out. Travel broadens the mind. This one is just right down the stairs to the left. Oh, poor little guy. All right, next we're going to Professor Fig's classroom. Across the hall from it, actually. I try to do these alphabetically as much as possible. So we're going to Professor Fig's inside the astronomy tower. All right, there's his classroom. We're turning around, going right into the bathroom. Normally, you want to turn invisible when you first come in here, but I've already opened this chest because I had uh, uh, I, need, I was in dire need of a same-day payday loan. Um, I needed to buy some supplies, and I ran out of money. So I pilfered from that one ahead of time. All right. Next, we're going to the bell tower. And courtyard now if you're at this orientation we're going up the left hand set of stairs I wonder what that little cloud is from All right, um, next we're going to the beast classroom. Our next one is gonna be right over, right over there. Um, there's a number of glitches in this game. I've come up this set of stairs coming through that door and those that platform has been gone. Um, we're going to maybe potentially experience a glitch coming up um, when we go by the Slytherin common room. We'll see if it happens. We're going to save the game right beforehand. Um, the next one that we're going to do is you can do Hogwarts, uh, the bell tower, then Hogwarts... Uh, North exit, but I really like the flying system in this game, so let's take a little flight. If you're coming in from here, you'll just go right up these stairs.
Oops, sorry. Fat fingers. Alright, we're going to save right here. Suggest that you do that. Um, don't be like my friends. My friends will literally only save on one spot and one spot only. And they will never touch anything else ever in the history of ever. So, I'm going to save right here. Because I have had the glitch happen a couple of times on this game. Where I go through this door and there's a force field and I can't get in. So, first thing we're going to do, pick the lock. Probably should have picked the lock first and then saved it, but... Yep. There it is. The lock picking in this just gives me anxiety because I never know if it's going to click or if I just move my fingers at the last second and it didn't work. Okay, it did not glitch. So if it glitched, you would run into a, an invisible wall. You can jump on top of the wall, but you can never get to, down to the ground. And the only way to fix it is to uh, reload the game. It's a beautiful game. The first run through that I did on my Gryffindor, um, I did not have issues with glitches other than not being able to collect the final um, bounty because one of the uh, field pages glitched, but that's a completely different story. All right, so now we're going to the Great Hall in the Vida Courtyard. If you have glitches in the game that you guys have experienced, um, you know, feel free to post them below. Um, if you have video of it, I'd like to do a video on some of the glitches for the PS5 in particular, but any of them would be kind of cool. I'm sure that Avalanche Games is aware of it. Um, on the PlayStation side, everybody else gets updates except for us, and although we do have an ex exclusive quest, so I guess that's a good trade-off. Except I'd like to be able to finish the damn game on my Gryffindor. I'm like three th collectible items away and I can't get them. All right, so now we're going to the library annex, divination class. All right, we're actually going up into this little walkway area here. Now, it's kind of funny that they have people standing over here because this is where we need to go, and then you figure the eyeball chest would be like, oh, look, there's people here. I'm going to, like, open up and nobody can get near me. But, nope, he just says, I only care about you. I only have eye for you. So cute. All right. Now we're going to go to Library Annex. We're going to the Greenhouse. Now this one's down in the aquarium area, but now is it really an aquarium if it's just plants, or do you need fish in order for it to be an aquarium? I'm not sure how that works. See, I don't think there's any fish in there. But it is an aquarium of sorts. All right, next, um, library annex again. So we're going to the restricted area. So we're going to the library. I've seen people do videos on things, and they'll start you at the Great Hall and then have you go all the way through to the library. I'm like, there's a flu flame inside the library, sir. What the hell is wrong with you people? Every time I go to the right. I have no idea why. All right, so... Here, fall down and open it. I've done that. We'll take the long way for those who are not feeling so adventurous. Mm. 
All right, two more to go. This one is going to be in the secret uh, map chamber, so secret rooms, map chamber. Just making sure my mic is working. Okay, and turn around, go up the stairs. What are you up to now? A lot of you probably got this one right away when you did your first trial. All right, last one is in the south wing. Now there's two ways to get to this one. You can do the hospital wing and go down the stairs or you can do the faculty tower, go up the stairs. Apparently this room is only restricted if you uh, are at night, and even then they don't give a shit. It's only when you do that one mission. Oops, one more, up one more set. I think the level 2 and level 3 joke locks are kind of a joke. It would be kind of cool if they had some sort of extra added element. Something to um, make them a little bit more complex. It also would be really cool if you had like a item that you could pick up that would automatically unlock level 1 locks um, for free. So you wouldn't have to sit there and fuck with them. Okay, um, sorry I was rattling on there. We're going through here. Okay, now if you look, we are super semi-rich. We'd be richer, but I already spent the money from the first set. Um, that is the entire uh, 13 that are in Hogwarts. Um, certainly feel free to um, like and share. I'd really appreciate that. Um, subscribe, obviously. I'm trying to get the, the subscribers up. I don't, I'm really just having fun. Um, I'd like to have more of a following. That'd be cool if there was more interaction inside the comments. But ultimately, I'm just having fun with this um, and creating some videos and content. So please do um, like and sub and, and interact. I'd appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video.